Let me make this very passionate appeal to all our esteemed viewers and subscribers. BVI Channel 1 needs an urgent bus for our mobility. This car is no longer serving. And this year, we need to cover a lot. And we need effective mobility, just like this bus, a Siena bus car. We are looking at between 3 to 4 million naira to secure this bus. And we depend on your contribution and donation. Please donate through the account you're seeing on the screen or you call the following numbers that is also on display. 0810-4545-533 or you call 0810-420-7522. We look forward for your donation to help us serve you better. Yeah, esteemed viewers, subscribers all over the world, Nigerian people. During the Armed Force Remembrance Day, the one of this year, 2021, um, we had the president of Nigeria in the normal ritual of setting free white doves, the call pigeon, you know, had a dramatic turnaround. They fly high and show that our great nation Nigeria is in absolute harmony. Insurgency, herdsmen, kidnapping, the nation is closely integrated and living in peace. We will see the birds of pigeon, they fly high soon, signifying we can see them. There they go. There they go. Put your hands together, if you will, please. Put your hands together. No. There they go. Anything whitish is, uh, signifies peace. You know, in that normal tradition, the president is expected to open up a cage filled with um, the pigeons and opens it up and let them fly and boom all of them we just fly just like we've always witnessed but this year's own the pigeon decided to protest they are protesting the impunity of the government in power they are protesting on behalf of thousands of nigerian soldiers nigerian troops that have fallen victim of the compromised fight against Boko Haram. Why do I call it compromised? You have had the, the armed men, that's the men of the military, Nigerian military, complain bitterly that they are not well funded, that they are not well equipped, they are not well motivated. But these things have been provided for, but because of the corruption and impunity in the system at the highest places, they don't get these things. And many of them have died. Hmm, many men don't follow. Don't so the Allah. Uh -huh. It's not easy. I swear. Many men don't fall, so we just got to go out. If army is ready, if Nigeria is ready to fight them, they should call us back. We we'll fight those idiots. But we don't have enough weapon, enough adequate weapon to fight them. So we can't just be wasting our life. We have families. You are talking through talk. But without weapon, we are not a soldier. Weapon makes us to be a soldier. Let them provide the weapon and we fight the idiot out. But it's not that they will give me this and then they will come with something more than this time. Steady. Oh boy, I know. I have blood in myself. So blood runs through me. So we just have to go. We are going home. Let us go and do the new year with our family. If the army is ready, let them call us back with the adequate weapon. At some point, they even have to face mutiny because they were ambushed of what couldn't have ever happened. They don't even have the aerial support in some of these of their fight against Boko Haram. So the pages are protesting. They, are, they have taken to the civil disobedience 
of not flying. They sat in one place. And the president has to bow his face down in shame and walk away. If the pigeons, if the animals in Nigeria, if the birds of the air within this territory called Nigeria feels the impunity happening in the system, then it has gone beyond the natural. It has gone beyond the natural. You know, so many people are saying, oh, this thing, you know, you know, they treat with king gloves and try to politicize it. No, this is, this has spiritual connotation. Don't forget I'm the voice of the people and the voice of the gods and the voice of our ancestors. I'm telling you as inspired, since this thing happened, I decided to keep quiet until I got the message to deliver to the Nigerian people. If the pigeons could protest, if the pigeons could sit one place and said they are not going to be part of this charade you call Am um, First Remembrance Day of 2021, what makes you believe that participating in covering the shame of the impunity happening in Nigeria, uh, what makes you think this is going to turn out good? These pigeons have sent a strong message. Why would they fly when the blood of innocent Nigerian youths are still fresh? The blood that was drenched in the soil of this country, it is still fresh. Asking for justice. Why would the pigeons fly? What are you celebrating? What are you celebrating? Nigerians, finally, you have come to terms to agree with me that Nigerians are victims of Nigeria. And if you sit back with and think not, not every, everly after praying something with honor, you know we are very religious people, my dear, we will betide you. Nothing will ever change. So, I want to appreciate you if you share this video. Don't forget, I'm dropping this video right here on our new BVI Entertainment channel because we are suspended for one week. But I will still upload it on our main channel when the suspension has been lifted. But meanwhile, subscribe to this platform to get every update because we are not stopping. We are not stopping at anything until you are well informed. Thank you for watching this far. I am Silas Suchin and Peter, the voice of the people, the voice of God, the voice of our ancestors. Share this video and let me have your thought under this comment section. We can set ourselves free. Nobody will do that for us. Every Nigerian is a victim of Nigeria. Stay safe. Bye-bye.